Testing, testing. Are we working? Let's hope so. We haven't used this center thing for uh, since the European mission, and that was uh, pretty much a disaster. Working that one out while we were going around. But uh, yeah, I don't know. The blue light's flashing on both things, so maybe we are tethered. But yes, look at this. You have to excuse the state of the cave. It's uh, a bit of a danger zone in here at the moment. We've got Kira, young Sergeant Fingers bike that we're rebuilding there after the European mission. I haven't let you into all that story yet, but uh, yeah, I need to do some uh, do some editing. And, yeah, there's my beautiful baby. I took her out the other day, first time in a month. Well, actually, since I got back from Europe, I think. And um, Jesus Christ, I thoroughly recommend have a month off of your sports bike and then go back on it. Amazing how quick I feel. And then, of course, we've got the honey badger. Not that honey badger, poor little bastard. But no, well, I've uh, nicknamed the old GS here. That's, um, in case you're wondering, it's after uh, some South African tank thing that uh, is pretty hardcore. So, yeah, she's got that kind of resemblance to her. So, yeah, I thought it was quite apt. It's also the company lo- um, mascot being the only badger. But um, that's a whole different story. So, yeah, what are we doing? We're going on a little mission. So this is the start of the Honey Badger Chronicles. Watch your man as any to represent and you're watching Blackness Rides. Had a nice bit of feedback on the site. Well, on the, on the channel. Thank you for all your uh, all your input, good and bad. So yes, what we're doing now. It's not a huge mission, but uh, yeah, we're going to get out. But the greatest of days for it. Thick fog right across the country. They've cancelled planes and all sorts of things. But uh, yes, so we're going to test her out. We're going to get off this rock. The Isle of Black, down here in the deepest, deepest south. And uh, what I'm going to do, I'm going to head to Ace Cafe, north of London, just to drop in there, just for nostalgia purposes, something to do. And then I'm doing that en route up to my mum's, going to pop in, see her, and then uh, after that tomorrow, then go on up to see my gran. She's in a home up in St. Ives. And then from there... I'm going to go up two Sergeant Fingers up in uh, Yorkshire and hopefully find some uh, trial or something interesting to do on the way. But yeah, it'll give me a good chance to uh, check out the old girls. You can see she, we've got her fully loaded. I always carry too much stuff. It's actually a lot less than uh, when we've done a European mission on the old blade. But this is purpose built for it. So yeah, spare gloves, laptop, clear visor. All that essentials in there. Him, he's another little mascot. That's uh, my little girl gave me a uh, teddy bear. I've got to carry everywhere. It's kind of lucky. I don't know why. I feel sort of a bit naked without it. But all the GoPro kit, little spare jackets, some boots, cloths in there. My overnight bag, all the essentials. And that is pretty much. I, I could go away quite happily for a month with uh, what we got in there. It was a learning curve going to Europe because I took way too much stuff. I could probably do with less than I've got on here now. But yeah, but she is going to weigh some. Of course, she's got the uh, 30 litre fuel tank on this. And um, after I filled that up in the petrol station yesterday, I was like, Jesus Christ. Yeah, so uh, fully loaded with all that. This should, should make for a bit of an uh, interesting negotiation through traffic and all that. Oh. Mind yourself, love. Well, that was phase one. We successfully uh, negotiated her out of the garage without dropping and breaking my legs. As you can see, even though I've parked up on the side of the road, it's taken up a fair old chunk of the road. Oh, and I'll just point out that we are um, fully GS'd up. Not that I'm into that uh, motorbike snobbery at all. You ride the right, you ride a bike as far as I'm concerned. I'm seeing I ride all sorts of different ones. I'm like a kind of biker chameleon. I can blend in so many. But look, there we go, we've got the old faithful Alpha Star two cans and a pair of Wolf uh, 
waterproof enduro trousers. We're wearing rucker. Rucker's always nice. I'll push the bow out with that. You know, if you're going to do it, you might as well have the right stuff. I'll go uh, full on Arctic and uh, torrential rain. Full storm in this bad boy and uh, hopefully it will uh, hold up. Yeah, it's an expensive investment, but uh, quite worthy. Actually, postman's coming now. Do I wait for the postman? No, I can't just be asked. What's the time? I've got time to wait for the postman. Let's see what good is he's bought me. Hey, she, baby, I'm hot like a prodigal son. Pick up a lean, 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 flower, you the chosen one. Say hello. <laughs> Mate, you're famous. Go on, you're happier than she is. <laughs> so am I. <laughs> oh, yeah? Oh. <laughs> yeah, I've got one of these YouTube vlogs, so I'll just chat bollocks and, yeah. <laughs> 